we've been very busy of late building end of the world wireless stations. Just as well I haven't thrown too much stuff away, you never know when you might need it. Would you believe I cleaned this place up a little while back but uh, with the busy activity it's just uh, got messed up again. With the worldwide chip shortage we have to make do with 75 year old vacuum chips. It's really like wartime, you have to make do with what you've got, can't go down to J car anymore, so just as well I kept all my old resistors. I never thought I'd need all these capacitors, but we're in wartime economy standard now, you have to make do with what you've got. I was going to use this old school amp as a modulator. But unfortunately most of the 6CM5s I've got are low on emission. I did the measurements here, measured the plate current and uh, most are down. I can only fi find six that are vaguely okay. All the rest were obviously salvaged from old TVs when the valves were basically uh, past their use-by date or had been stuck in uh, school amplifiers for 50 years on and uh, have lost emission. Although all the 807s seem to be okay. This is the latest version here. We can't have too many end of the world stations going. That's uh, using a power transformer as a modulation transformer and another one as a choke. Now it modulates quite well. There we are. You need to have that super um, nice waveform even at 100% modulation there it's clipping and you can never have too much drive look what happens when you turn the drive down that's why a lot of people sound distorted and crappy because they don't push the valve enough low drive up to normal drive and linear up to 100%. If I drop the drive there, if I drop the drive, look what happens. It all just breaks up. There's the matching unit to uh, transform 50 ohms into the grid impedance of the valves, which is quite low because there's four in parallel. At least being a wood front panel it's easy to drill holes in. And the number two version I'm working on at the moment. It used to be Mr. Adelcox long wave transmitter. Seems to be blowing a storm like the Dickens outside. Well there you are, using all the parts you've got. Which you've stored for years, thought were never going to be any use, but it just shows in times like these when you just can't go down to Rockby or J Car to get new parts, have to use what you've got. And I think the way things are going, um, it's a good idea to keep your parts because you never know when you might need to use them.